what up everybody welcome back to another bmx streets video this is a super cool little spot that i found tucked away in the downtown part of the map here in between these buildings you actually have to climb up this uh this fire escape just to get to it but it's a cool little spot double half pipes with some other little sections tucked away to the sides i'm gonna ride those and also i think the rooftops are rideable as well i'm gonna try and make that happen from both sides we'll see if i can ride from both sides in this video and do some pretty big drops this should be pretty cool fun little spot here and uh let's let's see how it rides in the game the death yard it's called the death yard you can see the skulls up there there's actually a lot of like skull and skeleton imagery around here so it's got a little theme to it kind of cool um definitely makes it a unique spot I want to try and air over this channel right here. It's a super wide channel, so trying to get the speed is going to be tough for it. Okay, that was the gap. Super low, but <laughs> I made the gap happen. Yeah, there we go. It was on the other side, but still. Oh, I'm going to slam right there for sure. You know, a lot of people telling me there's not enough street. You can find street wherever you want to find street out here. Nice transfer across there. Can I go back? <laughs> I went back all right. I might have been off the bike, but I transferred over. At least with my body. big flare across that that channel right there all right so in the brown section here i want to try and air the corner so i want to take off from one side right over here and i want to land over here and that's really possible because of the physics of this game pipe would be really really difficult to do that transfer the way that game worked but this game, I feel like it should be a lot easier and it should actually work nice and smooth. Yep, that works so nice. So before I go and start climbing on these rooftops, one thing I do wanna do, that was super smooth, uh, is explore this area down here just a little bit more. <laughs> because I do know that there's some cool spots down here before I start climbing up and trying to just do some crazy drops. I'm gonna go wall ride, 180 bar, fakey manual. Okay, I wanted a manual a little bit longer than that, but that's what I'm going for. Man, this game is smooth. Okay. <laughs> I barely manualed up on top for like half a foot maybe. Okay, all right. The pivot 180 out was nice. I like that little pivot half cab. <laughs> There's a ramp there. Speaking of that ramp, I'll double peg to backflip bar. That was a super sketchy little transfer. Oh my god. Let's see. How do I get up there? I guess maybe here. Yeah, so we've got stairs. Oh, not stairs. They're, they're ramps. But you can just keep going all the way up. <laughs> yeah, this is nice, dude. I like this. This is going to be fun. Yeah, all right. Now we're up on top. Let's see if I can actually drop in right here. This is going to be ridiculous. <laughs> I think it's going to work. I might blow out at the bottom, though. Oh, my God. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> All right, gonna try that again. See if I can at least transfer into the pipe down there. I know that I can make it. Dude, I hit that edge again. It's super skinny, so. Yeah, oh, that was so smooth. That's not what I was going for, but that was smooth too. The 
Flips are super slow rotator. That was a super clean double backflip. I'm gonna go up higher and see <laughs> what I can drop off of from up here. So you can get all the way up on these roofs. This is crazy. Oh yeah, it's definitely meant to be dropped off of. So sick. I don't know the speed I need to go for this. That was a little bit too much. Oh, that's what I need to do. I need to gap down to here. That's cool. There's like a, a landing spot right there. <laughs> that's huge. Got a little more speed this time. I need to go further left. So I made the gap, but my game like froze up as it was trying to load in the rewards. So I'm gonna have to try and do this again. <laughs> there we go. I don't know what to do right there though. <laughs> I got my head stuck in between the bars. <laughs> Breakdance simulator over here. I don't know how to get over that bump without flying straight into this quarter pipe. To double peg? That was sick. Oh, there we go. Oh, I just blew it. Okay, there we go. That's how you do it. So you just anti-pump. <laughs> In the fakie. All right, nice. I'm going to go back up to the top of the building and try and get the gap and then see how big of a... Um, how big of a air I can get on that massive quarter pipe right there. Oh my god, that should not have been possible. Dude. Quad whip. Oh, it just messed up the anti-pump there. Okay, there we go. Yeah, oh, that was so smooth. <laughs> Dude, this game is satisfying when you just do some crazy stuff like that. All right, so I want to try and figure out where the takeoff is for this drop. It's just got to be straight up there. Dude, there's another one on that roof over there. How do I even get to that? Okay, I see. I think. Yep, and there's one straight across. I wonder if I can drop into the half pipe from here. Yep, I think so. I need a little bit more speed. Dude. Up onto the fire escape? Almost. Get rid of the bike. Oh, I didn't mean to face plant. Oh my god. Or this thing. Because I don't need it. I don't think. I just gotta make that jump. Oh my dude. <laughs> I like straight through it. Maybe right here. You can get onto these and climb the ladder maybe yeah okay there we go this is gonna be slow going but this is how you do it <laughs> the way i was doing it was not right here we go up on top and now we've got another gap right here in the middle this should go down to that quarter pipe that really massive quarter pipe about to see and i went straight to flat but that is where that goes come on right here yeah, oh, I thought I had it. Why did I slam? I spoke too soon. Come on, right here. Yeah, you see how the game, it kind of wigs out a little bit right there. Because it's trying to load in the rewards that you just got. That was actually pretty tough. You have got to go the perfect speed to get that gap. I'm going to hop up on the scaffolding here and see if I can transfer in. With the late whip and smacking my nuts until I cannot have kids anymore. Oh, ooh, into the half pipe, into the half pipe. Oh my god, that should not have been possible. That was so sketchy. All right, I think I can get up on the water tower, and then there's another gap that I need to find on the rooftop that's even taller over there straight ahead i think no it's over there where the other water tower is i think 
Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ride that little street section right down there, uh, straight in front of my guy, and then go up the fire escape right there on the other side, and then drop down and then do the gap from this building down into uh, the brown part there. We got Doge Love over here. Are you having a good time? I'm having a good time. Try and get a little bit more technical over here. I like the manuals in this game, but I will say that the pivots, the pivots are, um, they're a little sensitive. Like it really doesn't take too much to make the bike pivot, which can get a little irritating when you're trying to do uh, manual tricks. Oh, I see something right there. If I can bounce off the top of that ceiling and then right away from it. That'll be sweet. Ooh, I just bonked my rear tire on it. Try it again. Oh, <laughs> there we go. I wonder if I can... Yeah, I wonder if I can kind of flip into it, bounce off the top with both tires, and then right away. Yep, yep, there it is. That was so sketchy. But that's what I was looking for. I think a lot of people are disappointed, at least a little bit, with the street riding because it is different than pipe. It's a lot more, it's a lot more sensitive. Like, like I said, the manuals, you have to actually balance those. And I mean, you can see right there when you go into the tooth, the, uh, the back end wants to push out if you don't have it straightened up all the way. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Yeah, see, but you can do stuff like that right there. You can kick the back end out. You can hop out of it and make it look pretty clean. But it does take, it takes some time to get used to. I'm still not used to it at all. The street riding is really difficult. It's way tougher in this game than pipe. I am using the grind spin assist and really all that helps with is just locking into your grinds. It's still super difficult. <laughs> you can still see this game it does have some bugs but i know mash games he's been on it trying to get this thing squared away so i'm just excited to see where this thing progresses because the potential is here i mean i can see i can see the potential in this game it's just not there quite yet all right i'm gonna try and get up on this last rooftop here I'm back up on the first rooftop here. I think I see uh, right here. Okay. And then you can run across. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> There's a gap right there. So get the bike back. <laughs> there we go. Doesn't matter how you get here. As long as you get here, let's try and drop off this thing. I don't even know the angle to hit it. Oh, there it is, dude. Okay. Was that where the target was to land? Yep, that was it. Check this out. This is a cool, cool transfer right here. Yeah, over the channel. Oh no. <laughs> I appreciate you guys checking this video out. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, definitely let me know. Be on the lookout for more streets content to come because this game, like I said, oh my God, <laughs> like I said, it's definitely raw right now, but I do see the potential. I think that this game has a lot of potential. I loved pipe. I think I'm going to love streets when it's all said and done. So thank you guys so much and I'll see you all again in the next one.